Almonds became an important symbol for Israel very early on in the nation's development. After the Exodus, Moses received instructions to build the tabernacle, a portable sanctuary where God would meet with the leaders of Israel. The lampstand of the tabernacle was made to artistically represent an almond tree, with its detachable lamps shaped as stylized almond blossoms. Then, when faced with dissatisfaction over Aaron's leadership as the high priest, God miraculously caused Aaron's staff to sprout, bud, blossom, and produce ripe almonds overnight. This was a clear symbol of God's choice in priest, but also carried a decidedly stern warning with it. The staff was kept in front of the Ark of the Covenant as a sign to the rebellious so that they would not grumble and die as a result. The almond-bearing staff of Aaron became a warning to all who would strive against God. The almond tree appears again in the wisdom literature of Ecclesiastes 12, a chapter that's describing the end of life and encouraging the reader to remember God before the time when the people are afraid of heights and of dangers in the streets, when the almond tree blossoms and the grasshopper drags itself along and desire is no longer stirred. Then people go to their eternal home and mourners go about the streets. Commentators often remark that due to the almond tree's white blossoms, this may be referencing graying hair. But in this context, it may also reveal the almond's association with coming destruction. This association is again revealed in Ezekiel 7, which is describing the end of Israel. Verses 10 and 11 say, See the day, see it comes, doom has burst forth, the rod has budded, arrogance has blossomed, violence has arisen, a rod to punish the wicked, none of the people will be left. The blossoming rod of Aaron has again made an appearance, this time not just as a warning to the wicked, but because in their arrogance they have not heeded the warning of the rod, it now carries with it a sure punishment of sin. Almonds make another significant biblical appearance in Jeremiah chapter 1. During Jeremiah's call to become a prophet, God converses with him, What do you see, Jeremiah? I see the branch of an almond tree, I replied. The Lord said to me, You have seen correctly, for I am watching to see that my word is fulfilled. There seem to be two things going on here. First, God's using a play on words because the Hebrew word for almond sounds like the Hebrew word for watch. God is watching to see that his word is fulfilled. Jeremiah sees an almond branch. However, given the previously established symbolism of an almond staff as a dire warning from God, this also perfectly sums up what Jeremiah's main prophetic message will be. Judgment was coming to Judah because of their rebellion against God. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this spotlight, please like it, share it with a friend, and leave us a comment below on what you thought. Also, don't forget to click the bell and subscribe for the latest Bible discovery content.